Hello, welcome to channel 48. My name is Pok. Thank you for tuning in. In my previous video, I spoke about Oreo uh, that I wanted to present for the Galaxy S6 Edge. I wanted to make a nice video about it, but in fact, I tested the Oreo a little bit better. And in fact, the cam is not working. We're getting some crash of the Google surfaces. So in fact, it's not done yet. But from the same makers, I got another ROM that is Nougat uh, Android 7.1.2 that is amazingly stable, uh, very supported. It supports a wider range of, of, of Galaxy S6 family. So that, that is cool. You know, this ROM will be for, for several, several phones. And I created the multi iOS ROM from, from, from that ROM. So let's go ahead and install it. You're gonna see it, take a look at it before you're gonna download it, guys. Hey, leave this video. Okay, let's go into a recovery mode. We just hit the restart and we can choose for recovery. There we go. I'm gonna do a wipe, advanced wipe, Dalfix system catches, and we're gonna go to the installer, install, and then uh, we're gonna install. Um, where is it? The multi iOS ROM S6 all. So let's flash it and take a good look. What's gonna happen? Up here, you're gonna see that this room is powered by resurrection. And we're gonna hit next. Do you want to do a full wipe? I would say I already did it, so no. And up here you can see the models that this ROM is supported for. The G920F FD, the I, the K, the L and the S, that's the S6 flat. The Edge is uh, the G925F, the I, the K, the L and the S, but also the G920T and the W8, or the G925, what is it saying there, T, or the w8 you see that so all these models are supported only thing you have to do is choose the right model of your phone so i'm gonna hit next and there we go we're installing And the ROM is successfully installed. We go one back. We hit next. And we go one back. And now we're going to install Magisk. And this is version 1.6. Okay. I think that's it for now. We're not gonna flash uh, gaps yet because in fact we need uh, open gaps 8.1 for 64 bit devices. I'm not sure if I have it in here. Yes, there it is. But we're not gonna flash that one yet. We're gonna first reboot. Reboot to system. And this is the multi iOS Teamus ROM, eh, peeps. So it will be ready for this. Is this is iOS ready? I think I'm gonna call this ROM iOS ready. iOS multi iOS ready multi ROM. Because thanks to the 6000 icons that you will have in the, the X, X11 icon pack. You will immediately with one click 
transfer all the icons not as shown in the previous video before that we had to go through all the icons nothing like that anymore that is all updated it's now a matter of one click and then you're gonna get the look and feels and the only thing you will have to do is set it up and i'm gonna show you an easy setup a very fast and easy setup and there are only certain things that you will have to do to get your phone the way you would love to see it We're looking at the real-time boot uh, peeps i just want a real-time boot for you to see how long it takes and there we are and boom we are immediately in so now you can stay on this if you wish this is the lean launcher okay very nice very beautiful but you can also long press and you go to the home settings okay you go to the look and feels you go a little bit down oh let me see you go to the team you set it to dark first okay um i could size i can label we go on back at the glance you want to turn that off uh the search you want to turn these search bars off and icon pack you can choose ux11 icon pack and then boom you're done gonna go one back here look and feel um find hot seat hot seat icons set them to four okay icon size you can set that to extra large on this phone The grid, uh, you can set to, the grid rows, you can set to five on this phone. You see that? Now we're gonna slide up and you're gonna find out that all your apps are right here. With one slide, you will have all your apps in one go. If you also want these apps on your desktop, if you want the thing to look like an iPhone, I mean like this is the, the future iPhone looks, but if you still want to be on the old fashioned icon, uh, I, I, iPhone looks, then long press an icon and put it anywhere you wish on your desktop. Can I have an applause for that please? Yes, thank you so much. Thank you so much. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this what you're seeing is uh, is very beautiful and very stable. And the coolest is that it supports so many ROMs that makes uh, yeah that makes it really interesting for me to also promote this and to yeah kind of use this and test it out. And probably this will be already outdated. Oh, sorry, I already had that one. So I must see if uh, if we can get some update for it. So let's go to the settings here. Android 7.12, as you can see. Okay. SMG 925F. So only thing that we now need to do is uh, is uh, this is effect uh, unofficial uh, uh, yeah resurrection resurrection remix yeah that's how to say it the resurrection remix uh, get more information about the resurrection remix oh yeah we have no internet yet but up here you can go ahead and and find uh, updates I think and. Altan KRK, co-founder, head developer, UX designer, maintainer. That is Altan KRK, Farun Date, head developer, UX designer, Akil Narang and Brian Koloch, Andres Pascual, Christopher Cardas, 
Matt Thomas and Justin Jiggle. These guys, they are all, you know, involved with this project that you see here. So, um, yeah, for the updates, etc., you you should check out that 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 site and check out that part of of this room. Uh, for the rest, you're gonna have everything inside, including a privacy guard, so you can actually be a boss on your device. You can go to the privacy guard, enabled by default, advanced, and up here you can go check all the rights of all the apps that we uh, have in this in this room. And you can block whatever you wish from not happening. You see that? I mean, like camera start at boot, run and background is not needed. You know? Because when you make a picture and you just go back to the home screen, then the camera is still on, on the background. It doesn't have to keep awake. Keep awake for what? You see? These are the things of, but that has nothing to do with the ROM. That has to do with 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 Android. That's how Android works. Google. So, so yeah, that is it, uh, guys. Uh, it looks uh, very nice. As you can see here, no big deal. The icon pack is is nice and friendly. Uh, the lean launcher same thing lean launcher is is not not even to be found somewhere here this it should be here somewhere lean here it is lean launcher it can call the phone, but you can ignore that if you wish. Because, you know, the phone is in the launcher. But I think if you now can hit the phone, ah, it still works, you see? So, in fact, you can block that. It doesn't necessarily have to make phone calls. Keep awake and start that boot. I would leave that on. Otherwise, you're going to have no launcher when you're going to start the phone. So that's it guys and girls, a beautiful room powered by the guys that I just called, Resurrection Family, and uh, it's suitable for all these iPhone, I mean Galaxy Samsung S6 phones that uh, you saw passing by during the install. So it will also be written all in the description. So go read it again. This room, I'm going to host it. And you can download it from my media fire. But uh, nevertheless, all the credits for the Android to Resurrection and the guys that I called earlier.